Hi. Today's film is, uh, well, uh, I've seen those solar heating things on the internet and I wanted to build one. They looked simple, but it has to be really simple. Now, before I started this, I, uh, I discovered ways to make it far, far simpler. Because I'm not a handyman, so like a lot of people say, yes, if I can build it, anyone can. But they have a lot of tools and experience. Me, I don't. But anyways, so I went back to my original project only because I started it and uh, I glued the some of the insulation in and I didn't uh, want to, you know, there's nothing I could do. I had to finish it, so, or throw it out because I couldn't use the metal because I had glued the insulation in already. So anyways, I'll just turn this around and uh, show you my cans. <laughs> I enjoyed saying that. What I used was a, uh, what, four foot by three foot or something like that, uh, old fluorescent light fixture that holds eight tubes. And no one was using it, so I took it and, uh, I'm going to use more of those as frames for other projects, but the can thing I've given up on, but I'm going to finish this one. Anyways, as you see, I have my cans here. I have eight rows, nine cans tall. I was going to use nine, but it didn't leave me enough, um, it didn't leave me enough room for insulation, because being metal, you know, it's made and it's the right size, but I, I have to insulate on the sides. Now, um, what I'm going to show you today is me drilling out the last 12 cans, and I glue them in threes, and then tomorrow I'll glue those onto the tops of here so it'll fill up the thing. Then tomorrow I'll use a bit of insulation, insulate along here and the bottom one, and then along the sides, and uh, then we'll continue. But anyways, I'll show you me um, drilling out the cans. Here are my last 12 cans uh, that I have to drill. I'll show you how I did this. By the way, this is a no-name brand, but interestingly, 33% less sugar. And I, I had the kids at work try these and empty them for me, and they didn't notice a difference. So I applaud this company, Life Brand, for, uh, here, I'll zoom in, for giving us something with less sugar but just as much taste. And it appears my battery is almost dead, so I, so I have to make this quick. I'll just get my drill ready and we'll begin drilling and gluing. I decided to go with one, uh, what, um, three-eighths inch hole in the bottom. Uh, I've seen some places where people cut out the whole bottom, but having a small hole or series of small holes will you know, cause the air to flow a bit more slowly and gain more heat? I'm hoping, because I'm too lazy to cut the bottoms out. Anyways, I'll continue with those, and I'll show you how I glue them next. I also did something that's eluded many professionals for years. I think Yes, I've kept, I've kept my silicone 
from drying out. I just wrapped plastic around it. Probably not the official thing I should do, but pff, what the hell. I'm just putting silicone around the bottom. I don't know if it's enough or too much or just right, but I'm just guessing. Now, once I do that, all I do is take the other can, put it on top, And I'll try to make three cans, and then I'll leave them till tomorrow. And tomorrow, I'll uh, finish off the cans, and I will start to finish the project. I don't know how long it'll take me, but, uh, oh yes, uh, as life would have it, As life would have it, uh, today is a perfect day for testing out this contraption, but uh, we shouldn't be getting much of any sun for two weeks. So, uh, well, that's the way it goes. You know, you, you plan something and then you don't get the chance to do it for a while, but that's okay. You know, that's, that, that's cool. Anyways, um, I'll show you this, I guess, tomorrow when I put the rest of the cans together. Uh, I hope you enjoy, and uh, we'll continue with our little uh, film. Bye.